It has emerged as one of the fixtures on the English football calendar and with good reason. Manchester City against Liverpool, mouth-watering to say the least. Next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to our coverage on what is a very soggy night here at the Etihad Stadium in Manchester. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and my partner ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk is Stuart Robson and it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester City taking on Liverpool. Well Derek, when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Kovacic and return to Grealish can he finish couldn't quite hang on and in the end no damage done and so they start at 11 for Manchester City Ederson between the posts Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks Jack Grealish plays with Phil Foden out wide and the lone striker today is Erling Haaland Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander Arnold in the fullback positions. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Oh, good looking run. Grealish. Oh, the referee points to the sport. Penalty. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. This to make it 1-0. And he puts it away confidently. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. Well, Liverpool restart the game. A wake-up call for them, perhaps. Ake, Grealish, well there to intercept, and he might be through here, and a goal, an end-to-end -end game, and they weren't behind for long. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Grealish. City moving the ball forwards, what can they do from here? Gakpo Mo Salah well it didn't happen for them in attack it might still be problematic Diaz well hit with power and almost the right precision Diaz. Here's Kovacic. Mateo Kovacic. Grealish. Stones. Walker now. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Can he fire it towards goal? Oh, he saved it well. Oh, 
and the short option preferred. Alvarez and a decent save for credit. It's a short one. Foden looking to cut inside. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. So, Bosloy, this might be ideal for the counter. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, the referee not messing about. He's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming. It's looking promising. Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. Mateo Kovacic. Holland. Here's Kovacic. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Alexander-Arnold. He's in here. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him apparently. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. And that is going to be all for the first 45, then, here at the Etihad Stadium. So the second half underway, and no doubt about it, City with work ahead of them. And given acres of space to attack here. Spot on with that tackle. So Bosloy. Potentially productive here for Liverpool on the flank. Chance to finish. Liverpool pushing to add to the lead. It'll be a corner. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Good clearance. Salah. Top class defending. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Can they make it count? Oh, good save. Well, I can't believe City are losing here. They've created so many good opportunities. But unless they score soon, they'll start to get frustrated, that's for sure. First things first, they need possession of the ball. Real chance. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. A change in the offing for City. Gvardiol. Silva and Bernardo Silva has it now Holland trying to open them up real chance just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and Salah does the rest. 
He strikes it so cleanly. He hits it with power and accuracy. There was no stopping that. Well, the action continues. And no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Rodri. Oh, they have it again. And into the last 20 minutes. He has teammates around him. And let's give credit to the defending. Breaking at pace. Have to pay attention defensively. All in all, a broken counter-attack. So Bosloy. This is Salah. Ball retention so important. Gvardiol. Rodri. Might be able to produce from this position. Getting forward. Can he finish? Brilliantly blocked. Nicely cut out. Bernardo Silva. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. And just five minutes remaining. This could be troublesome. There's the goal. Surely now that is that. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Bernardo Silva. Walker now. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Oh, managing to beat him. Foden. Hold on! And there it is! A goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. And that is all for this game anyway. It goes into the books as a victory for Liverpool. Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And of course, he scored two really good goals.